what is up youtubers here is my 12 yes 12 in one arcade machine games include robotron sinistar joust timber bubbles defender rampage satan's hollow wizard of war beer tapper splat and defender number two this arcade machine is really really fun has great qua uh, great quality and everything like that. So we're gonna turn it on. Hope you guys can see it. And I'm gonna turn the the uh, noise down a little bit to why not 20. All right. So here's buttons. Two joysticks. Six buttons on each side. A reset button. A little light for some reason. Uh, the joysticks are in good condition. And here we have a, a configuration menu, and you can set up games so you can have more lives. And yeah, it's pretty cool. And I'm gonna set, we're gonna play Robotron, and I'll be right back. All right, so we're gonna start playing a game. It's gonna be Robotron. By the way. I'd like to ask a few uh, subscribers how you like my um, camera. It's been I've been recording with it for a while now. If you haven't noticed, my quality has been getting better since I've stopped using my computer to record stuff. Finally got a camera. Next, I need a flash drive or whatever they're called. Alright, so you can see that uh, at the hard or the whatever, the game section, I made it so that, um, ah, they're really firing at me. Alright, so you can see at the game section up there, I made it so I had, uh, five lives to start instead of three. Alright, so now we're going to, uh, play Root Beer Tapper. After you saw a couple gameplay from uh, Robotron, which is a really fun game, by the way. So the objective in this game is to uh, just serve them out of here. It's simple. The rounds start to get more hard and they start to change the maps. So it's not the easiest game. Alright, here's where we have to watch closely. Gotta find the one that he didn't shake. Like that one. And try to keep your eyes on it. Or in this case, my finger. Ah! This one. Alright, so next is gonna be Satan's Hollow. This game always brings me a lot of thrill, and, um, it's, it's, it gets real hard as you play. So the whole point is to bring these bridge pieces and kill these guys. So you have a fun. Now this is me failing at this game. <laughs> I'm sorry. Whatever. Whatever, I'm gonna keep playing, and all you have to do really is kill these guys and progress through the levels. Um, you have a shield that you can have, and, um, uh, when you finish that bridge, you can go over and, um, kill a boss. Not this one. Different one. This boss is just way too easy. Alright, now watch. We just finished the bridge so we get a bonus level. A big guy is gonna be going real fast. And our reward is a lot is like a lot of points up there. And then we get rapid fire. Epic, right? This really helps in this level. Look at that. Isn't that just like so beast mode? And this shield can help too. Oh wow. Get real. I think I'm gonna let you have that. <laughs> and see, this boss is really easy. Just recommend if you want to keep this, you just don't die. Alright, uh, really simple. So this game is fun. 
I enjoy it. Especially when you get all this stuff. And it gets really, really complicated though. Madness. Boops. Alright, now I'm gonna go over and see if I can defeat him again. If I can, that's really good. Ah! Look, he, get, he gets much, much, much harder progressing through the levels. Next game is going to be Timber, the same creators of Root Beer Tapper. The main objective of this game is to chop down all the trees before your time limit goes out. Don't let these trees fall on you, or else you'll definitely get stunned for three seconds and won't be able to chop. And that's a bad thing, because you don't get that much time. And the more time you have to spare, the more points you get. Every second is 100 points. As a bonus. And the same as Root Bears have, since they're the same creators, they have a uh, darn good way of a bonus level. You get to uh, run on a log this time, though, instead of keeping memory of the Root Bear cans. And watch out for these honeys, or these, uh, wow, well, that was really, really good. But anyway. Watch out for the bears throwing uh, bees, because that'll hurt you and waste a life. Ah! And if you don't complete all the trees before um, the time limit goes out, he'll come and like hit your head on the ground, like literally. Alright, here's the bonus. Try to stay on the log as long as I can. Wow. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh no. I did better than the last time. Alright, so you get the point of this game. Alright, so now I'm in the mood to play some Rampage. This game, uh, me and my cousin always played. Um, you can also change it so I can be this other guy. Alright, so the main objective is destroy everything. Just destroy. You got two simple buttons, really. The attack button, and then when you destroy the building, I'm eating everything. The jump button, just right next to the attack button. This game is uh, really easy because all you have really have to do is click the jump button after you die to just have to just respawn. You don't lose lives after that. So it doesn't really matter. This game, you have an infinite life. You could say it. Um, I'm not going to play that much because I don't have my cousin with me. But if I have my cousin with me uh, later one day, I'll, I'll post a video of that. We'll definitely post it on his channel. There will be a link in the description um, to tell you his channel. Going to his channel. He has really good drawings, it's just that he's not doing them, doing the drawings as often. Alright, so that's pretty much the point of the game, just destroy everything. Alright, um, let's go on to the next game soon. Alright, now we're gonna play Splat. Uh, this game, all you do really is just like a food fight. Pick your character, and get a weed. Alright, stuff will be falling from here, and then you have an opponent, and really easy. Ah! Ooh. Ooh. Um, then you get later levels where you got other people, like this guy, uh, the uh, scientist. He just hit him for me. Ah! Ah! And uh, 
Whole point is never stay still, really. Cause then they'll hit you. Then they get really hard. Ah! Oh no! Got him. Oh no! All right, so you get the point of this game. All you really do is just throw stuff, so it's not complicated at all. <laughs> Alright, let's get on to the next game. Let's play some Wizard of War. That's our next game. Alright, so this is the game, all you do is you have monsters that are coming after you. I don't play it. Wow. I don't like this. You have monsters that you need to kill. And these guys killing me. Alright, if he wants to kill me, I'll kill him. Yeah, take that. There. Alright, so, um... This is pretty much all you do, is just kill these guys. Sorry if my hand's in the way. I just, uh... Didn't know I had to play on the screen, I forgot. Or this side. Oh, thanks. You ran right into me. Um, actually. Oh, I, oh, what? How did I stay? Yeah, you can pretty much spray him. Alright, so that's what you do. You just shoot all these guys. It's pretty easy. Alright, so, wow. I don't know what this is. Oh, double points. Okay. Alright, let's get on to the next game, shall we? How's about Joust? We're gonna play Joust now. This game, all you have to do is kind of Mario based, except for you're not on Yoshi, you're on this magical bird that can fly and you can ride on it like these guys and you jump on their heads and they die but watch out because if they just tap you you die because I suck at this game too because I barely play it ah I killed one and grab those eggs they give you extra points and they have to low Yeah, it's pretty oh, I died again. There we go. Oh, yeah. Alright. Dang. There. 